Hello students, I hope you are okay at home. Welcome again in another online class for the students of class 5 of Life Preparatory School. Uh, today we are going to discuss some important phrases and idioms from your Applied English Grammar and Composition book by PC Dash. And we will also discuss about some important appropriate preposition from your Advanced Learner book for class 6 by Chaudhuri and Hassan. So let's start. At first we will discuss about the phrases and idioms. I think you all are watching a picture in the video screen and uh, there are some phrases and idioms uh, written there and we will discuss them and those are the important those are the important marked phrases and idioms for your model test 2 syllabus. I hope you all will learn them very well at home and practice them and uh, in your exam these phrases and idioms will be given and you have to make sentences with them. So we are going to start our lesson. At first we are watching that there is above all. Above all means more than anything else, more important than anything else and the Bengali meaning is shorbo puri, shop kichur pore, shop kichur sheshe. At number two, there is after all. After all means in spite of everything, despite everything. Shop kichur shottu, shop kichur pore. Number three, apple of discord. Apple of discord means a thing that is, uh, that is being quarreled for, that is being quarreled for, that is being quarreled for and it means number four is at all Ado is a negative adverb and it will be used especially in negative sentences I don't like him at all at number five there is uh, at sixes and sevens Sixes at sixes and sevens means something not uh, ordered, disordered, scattered. Um, that means bistring kolabostha jeta shadana gochana na elo melo abostha ache. Number six at stake. At stake means in danger. Bipode thaka, problem e thaka, shomusha e thaka. In number seven we can see that at the eleventh hour. At the eleventh hour means at the last moment. Shesh muhutte. Number eight is bad blood. Bad blood means a bad relation or not a good relation, ill feeling, monomalino, enmity, shotruta thaka. Number nine, black sheep. Black sheep is a worse person of a group or a family or a kind. Uh, that means, ek jon khara bhekti, sheta kono dollar hote pare, kono bhekti, group er, kono dollar hote pare, kono pori baare hote pare. At number ten, there is bigger description, bigger description that can be described, that can't be described. Borno na tito, ja borno na kora jai na. At number 11, there is bold from the blue. Bold from the blue, that means something happened suddenly, unexpectedly. At number 12, there is by hook or by crook. By hook or by crook, that means any cost, at any cost, anyhow, jekono mulle, jekono upai. Number 13, by and large. By and large, that means mostly, mainly, pradhanoto. By and large, Bangladesh is an agricultural country. Prodhan to Bangladesh ekti krishi prodhan desh ba krishi mulok desh. Number 14, bring to book. Bring to book that means uh, to uh, bring into punishment. Kauke shasti dawa. Number 15, there is burning question. Burning question that means uh, very a matter of a topic of very argument that uh, is being argued very much. The bibader bisho, tibro bitor ke bisho. Number 16 is carry the day. Carry the day means win for the day. Joy lap kora. Number 17, coke and bull story. That means uncanny and unreal story. Gaja khuri golpo, ashare golpo. Jeta ekdomi bishash jogo noy. Number 18, crocodile tears. Crocodile tears, that means a tears, a cry. Not, that is not real. That is not from your heart. Uh, maya kanna, mithe kanna. Number 19 is cut a sorry figure. Cut a sorry figure means uh, to make a worse result. Khara fola fol kora, jeko no kichite, shuffle na hoa. Number 20, dead against. Dead against means um, something truly and typically against of something, very bitterly. Tibro birodhi, ghor birodhi. 
number 21 end in smoke end in smoke that means um, failed or um, in vain jeta byartho hoye giyeche shofol hoyni number 22 fish out of water fish out of water that means a very uncomfortable uneasy situation khub oshostikor mane bhalo obosthana number 23 far and wide far and wide that means every place in everywhere shorbotro shob jaygay number 24 hard and fast badha dhara fixed jeta ekdomi uh, rules er baire jawa jabe na erokom khubi fixed number 25 hard not to crack that means a very uh, hard or uh, difficult or very uh, problematic situation or problematic matter khub kothin samoshya kothin byakti hote pare khetre jeta sadharono shohoje samadhan kora jay na number 26 is hue and cry that is noise commotion shorgol shobdo 27 hush money hush money that means uh, it's a corrupted money bribed money ghusher taka oshot upaye urjito taka number 28 in a fix samoshay pora um, bipode pora in a problematic situation number 29 in full swing that means in full execution puro dome shompurno rupe number 20 uh, 30 30 in time that means thik shomoyer modhe in a fixed time not uh, before that or not after that thik shomoyer modhe okay i think you have all gone through the phrases and idioms very well now we are going to learn our um, appropriate preposition and uh, you can see that there are some appropriate preposition and here is a bracket a b a b two letters are included here for model test 2 ab means appropriate preposition uh, will be taught will be taught from only a or b segment there are many more there are from a to z if you have seen your book appropriate preposition are given from a to z and we are going to learn only for a and b for model test 2 okay so i think you are going to uh, you are going to learn them very well and of course you will learn them very well now we are going to start our lesson so at first you are seeing that abide by abide by means to obey them mene chola kono kichu mene chola abide with shonge uh, thaka to live with i abide with my parents abide in kothao bash kora kono ekta jaygay bash kora that means we all uh, abide in dhaka or something in other places number 4 is abstain from abstain from that means to avoid or to refrain from Biroto thaka, eriye jawa, kono jaga theke na jawa. Number five is abound with, and there is uh, another almost same that is abound in. Abound with and abound in. Abound with kono kichu the purno thaka, beshi pori mane thaka, and abound in kichu puthu pori mane thaka. Dono ta ekhi system, dono ta ekhi rokom meaning. But if you see that abound with and the object, there will be an object abound with and abound in. After that, there will be a plus like uh, this place abound with many trees and many trees abound in this place so this place abound with many trees and many trees abound in this place after that we are having admit to admit to man hocche kono kichute bhorti hawa eta hospital bhorti hawa bojhate pare even it can be uh, meant for admission in another institution number 8 is agree with and you can see 8 9 10 agree with agree on and agree to and for this different preposition the agree meaning agree that means to cohere with raji hawa sammata hawa so all these preposition uh, meant differently for this agree verb so agree with agree with that means uh, to agree with a person and the object will be a person I agree with him and agree on agree on means to uh, to agree with any matter that means I agree on going there uh, and agree to means to agree to some offer or proposal that I agree with the proposal I agree to the proposal of this project I am a projector a proposal by post 
So, I agree with, I agree on and I agree to. After that, uh, at 11 number, aim at. Aim at, that means to um, purpose at. Kuno kichu dike lokho kora, tak kora. Number 12 and 12, 13 and 14, there are similar verb with different preposition. Attend to, attend at, attend on. So, attend to, attend to means uh, to be attentive. That means I attend to my study. You all attend to your study. Tomra shobai tomader pora prati mano jog dao. Attend at means uh, that means to attend a place. Uh, you are not attending at the school now. Tomra ekhon school e upostit thak chona. And attend on means to nurse or to serve someone. Karo sheba kora. That means we all should attend on our parents. Amra shobai amader baba mai sheba korbo. Baba amader shobari baba mai sheba kora uchit. At number 15, there is absent from, onupusthi thaka. Uh, number 16, addicted to, addicted to, that means ashok to hawa, and it is a negative, act, uh, ne a negative activity. You sh uh, there is meant uh, negative things you are addicted to, that means he is addicted to um, mobile phone. Uh, don't be addicted to a mobile phone. Mobile phone are putti ashok to hawa na, because it's a harmful thing. After that, uh, number 17, afraid of, bhito afraid of bhito that means i am afraid of everyone is afraid of ghost everyone is afraid of ghost and uh, if we see that after that there is alarmed at alarmed at alarmed at means shunkita hawa and worried about something alarmed at and uh, after that Alarmed at, angry with, angry with, karushat rak kora, that means I am angry with him. And annoyed with, konu kichur proti, birokto hawa, annoyed, birokto hawa. I am annoyed with him, ami tar proti birokto, tar shati birokto. And after that, anxious about, anxious about, worried about something. Number 22, ashamed of, lojito. That means to be embarrassed for something. Number 23, appropriate to, that is suitable. Number 24, hour of, concerned for something. Number 25, attentive to, that means uh, attentive to, to pay attention to something. Number 26, access to, to gain a communication. Shongjuk thaka, jogaduk thaka. 27, ambition for. Uchakan Kahawa ba Asha Thaka Kuno Kichu Juno Prutta Shakara Ambition Four. That means we all should ambition we sh we all have an ambition for higher study. Amade Shobari Uchutor Shikha Juno Akta Asha Ritse number twenty-eight argue with argue with Kuno Kichu Nye Torko Kora B Torko Kora number twenty one based on based on means bhitti Kuno Kichu Rupu Bhitti Kore Goreota and uh, there is after that believe in believe in that means to trust in something uh, 31 blind of and blind to blind of means uh, blind of is a uh, true blind true blind person that means and blind to that means it it's a symbolical meaning blind to dekheo na dekha jemon sometimes people are blind to Corruption. Madhya Madhya Manush corruption. Dekhe ho na dekhe. Duniti dekhe ho na dekhe. Acha. Then after after that we are having born of. And if you see 33, 34, 30, uh, 35, and 35 born to, born in, and born of. Born of and the object should be uh, a family. That means. He was born of a Muslim family, born to uh, John Modawa. Uh, male child was born to them. Mm, uh, Boro born of, born in. Uh, born in, that means it's a place I was born in Dhaka. Okay, after that, we are, we have here Boro from Karokas Teke Kunogichu Dhar Kora. Number 37, bound for. Uh, to go for something kono kichu uddeshye jatra kora and after that there is busy at 
best thaka to be inclined with something and after that burst into and burst out 39 and 30, uh, 40 burst into and burst out burst into uh, it is mean kannai bhenge pora whenever uh, we cry vehemently very uh, very suddenly kannai bhenge pora suddenly he burst into tears and burst out that means whenever we laugh very loud they burst out into a laughter so i think you have gone through them very well so today's lesson, there are two uh, topics we have discussed, that is phrase idioms and appropriate preposition. I think you all will learn them very well. So phrases and idioms are practiced, will be practiced in sentence making and appropriate preposition will be given in the exam as in the form of fill in the blanks. You will learn them very well, learn their meaning very well and you can also follow the sentences given in the passage. Um, so students are very again very well wish for you i hope you all will um, stay at home and stay safe and learn your lessons very well okay take you take care and allah